Alright guys, so for this tutorial I'm just going to jump right into it. I'm grabbing my Mineralize Foundation from MAC in NC35 and I'm just going to apply this all over my face. I am aware that it's slightly darker than my face right now, but I had a tan when I went to Punta Cana, so I have to match my body. Now I'm going to grab my concealer in NC25 Pro Longwear and I'm just going to highlight underneath my eyes. Um, Kendall has a really natural highlight so I'm going to then take my finger to really tap that in and blend it into my foundation. I also want to apologize because I'm kind of out of focus here. Clearly me and the camera are just fighting. Um, I promise it will get better throughout the video more so during the Kylie part of the video. So my apologies. <laughs> Now with the same concealer, I'm just going to tap that into the center of my nose and then use my finger to blend it out with my foundation as well to give a natural highlight. And I'm just putting this also above my lip and my chin. You want to remember everything here is all about being blended and natural because Kendall's look is very soft. I'm going to go ahead and put some concealer underneath of my brows. Again, I'm going to tap it to really blend it in because you don't want any harsh lines in her look. Now taking the Velux pencil in the color Fling, I'm just going to fill in my empty gaps in my eyebrows. Um, I really like this pencil for MAC because it's actually a pressed eyeshadow into a pencil, so it gives you a very natural look. Using my favorite eye primer, I'm just going to blend that out with my fingers onto my lids. And then I'm going to also blend out my uh, Studio Fix powder onto my skin. While taking brown script, I'm just going to lightly feather this all over my lid up until my brow, not covering the brow bone, but just above the crease so that we can fade it in with the brow color. The trick here is just to keep blending because you want the colors to just kind of melt in with each other to make it look as natural as possible. Now I'm going to grab my color Ploof and just put it underneath the brow bone and maybe a little bit on the lid as well to kind of brighten just the lid a little bit to give it a little shimmer. Now with a pencil brush, I'm just going to apply brown script underneath my eyes. So next I'm going to grab saddle with a detailed brush and I'm just going to wing out my line. Basically I just drag it out as I would a regular wing with a gel liner but I love this technique that all of the makeup artists for the Jenners have been using. It's like a very soft wing liner which is beautiful especially in this look. Next I'm taking a clean brush just to sharpen that line a little bit and to really like smoke it out. Now grabbing Twisted Lash by MAC, which is one of my favorite mascaras at the moment, I'm just going to go ahead and apply it all over my lashes. For Kendall's look, I decided not to do lashes because she has a very soft, natural look. Next, I'm going to take my bronzer in Laguna Bronze, I believe, from NARS, and I'm just going to go ahead and contour the uh, uh, my cheekbones, my nose, and my forehead. I'm also going to apply what I fancy blush onto my cheeks. I'm going to take my favorite bronzer, which I don't know what I'm doing there, um, and I'm going to just really, really feather that into the brush and apply it onto my uh, the high points of my cheeks. And I'm just going to make myself glow, glow, because this makeup look is all about the glow. You want to make sure to get your nose, your upper lip, your forehead, anywhere that you can glow, just apply it. Next, I'm taking Pleasure First, a huggable lip gloss by MAC, and I'm applying it all over my lips. I'm just applying Hot Mess onto the center, and with my finger, I'm going to kind of blend it out to give this tone a little bit more of a peachy tone. And I'm going to actually go over a little bit more with that huggable again, and just kind of create that lip gloss that Kendall has in the pictures. As soon as I saw this look, I just had to recreate it. It's all about the glow, the skin, ugh, I love it for the summertime. So Kylie's look is a lot more intense, more highlighted in contour, so off the bat I'm just going to intensify my brows and define them a little bit more using True Brunette by MAC. I'm just going in and really shaping them and defining them. Going back in with my concealer, I'm just going to intensify that highlight under the brow bone um, and I'm just going to really just pat that in and kind of just layer it on. 
So again, I'm just going to intensify all of my highlighting and contour. So I'm taking my concealer and really highlighting my nose. Next, I'm going to take the Hoola bronzer and just bronze my nose on the edges to really contour and shape and give myself a little nose job. Make sure to really concentrate on the inner part of your eye like I am there. Uh, in the picture, you can really tell that they really intensified that contour. So you want to make sure you do that as well. Next, I'm going to grab a little bit more of that blush and just intensify the blush as well as just taking that bronzer again and intensifying that contour. She has contour to the max, so you just want to make sure to blend everything out. Now I'm taking Other Earthly and I'm just going to intensify my uh, highlight on my cheekbones and my nose. You just want to make sure to layer on top of what you already had. Now for the nose, I'm just taking my ring finger and I'm going to drag a little bit of that highlight down the nose. For part of this look, I'm taking Antique by MAC and I'm just going to pat that onto my eyelids and then taking a 224 brush, I'm just going to blend it out, again blending into the brown script that we already had before. Next I'm taking Retrospect and I'm just going to layer that onto the lid. This is going to create that kind of champagne-y, golden brown bronze look that she has on the lid. Now using an angled brush, I'm just going to go ahead and intensify that wing liner using Embark. Not a gel liner, always a shadow to really smoke that wing liner out. Again, taking antiques, I'm just going to do it underneath my eyes to smoke out my eye like she has in the Met Gala look. Next, I'm taking Mary Luminizer and I'm just going to put it in the center tear ducts to give that golden color that she has. I also added a little bit of the bronze from Bobbi Brown in as well. So for Kylie's look, I added some lashes. These are Diva by Kiss. I love these lashes. They're very natural but also very flirty, which I really think was perfect for this look. Guys, why do I look so concentrated? Like, I've never done that before. <laughs> so I guess I decided tissues weren't a thing. I decided to wipe it off with my hands and I used um, World Lip Liner to line my lips. I'm going to go ahead and overdraw them just a little bit and I also want to blend that color into my lip. Next, I'm taking Literally by Kylie, and I'm just going to dab that all over my lips, and using my finger, I'm going to dab a little bit more to kind of take away a little bit of that shine. Alright guys, so that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed my Kendall to Kylie tutorial. Um, please make sure to subscribe, follow me on Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, all of the above, and until next time.